And now, let's select together a dry cooler. Just click on dry cooler. And we see that a new window is opened. Here, upstairs at the category, we'll edit brine cooler. We will just give in the capacity that we have. We typed in. And after that, we see that we have two cassettes, one for the medium and one for the air side. Let's concentrate right now on the medium side. We have the possibility to choose between a wide range of medium. Right now, let's stay with that in Anglicol. We can put in the concentration, the inlet outlet parameters, the inlet outlet temperature, maximum pressure drop in the coil. Please always let it on auto so that you have one bar in the coil maximum. This is completed. Let's go together on the air side. We just put in the air temperature, the relative humidity and the geodesic height. Please insert the geodesic height correctly because it has an impact when we are selecting the units.